We're seeking to eliminate all the prohibitions uh, that prevent New Jersey from having sports betting. At first blush, the bill proposed by North Jersey Assemblyman Ralph Caputo and South Jersey lawmaker John Berzicelli to eliminate any state regulations on sports betting seems bold. But the legislators say after the U.S. Third Circuit Court of Appeals shot down New Jersey's last attempt to legalize sports betting at racetracks and casinos, it left a door open with a final option. The court decisions indicate that uh, if they were, if those prohibition, prohibitions were eliminated, they would not be able to stop. That's the interpretation. So we're headed in that direction. There's a lot of work to do on this issue. An act from 1992 puts a federal ban on sports betting in the state. A New Jersey contingent, including Assemblyman Ralph Caputo, has been fighting it or seeking a way around it since 2009. Only four states, Nevada, Delaware, Oregon, and Montana, squeaked in under the 1991 federal deadline, allowing sports wagering. This bill, which is very much a work in progress, is really designed to be a message to the federal government and saying, listen, we believe this is a state's rights issue. Essentially, would take away all regulations related to sports betting. Assemblyman John Berzicelli refers to the measure as the nuclear option, not a perfect solution, but has the right intent. New Jersey citizens want to be able to bet on sports in a safe, controlled environment. The uh, Constitution reflects that. Our battle now is with the federal government who refuse to recognize this as a state rights issue. A new FDU public mind poll finds a majority of Americans support legalized sports betting, with 48 percent in favor and 39 percent against. Supporters say top reasons include the fact that it's already happening and would create more tax revenue for states, particularly in New Jersey, as it struggles to revive Atlantic City's economy. It's a gambit that we have to study and we have to look at. Uh, but it has to be controlled in a way that doesn't violate the federal ban, at the same time doesn't open it up to, uh, to abuse. State Senator Ray Lesniak will help draft the bill. He began the charge in New Jersey. He says if left unprotected, lifting regulations could create the Wild West for gambling. It would just allow anyone at any time, anywhere, any place, to, uh, to take bets on sports uh, games. And by the way, that was very much in the vogue when I was growing up in Elizabeth. I myself went to my corner grocery store. I experienced it. Uh, we bet on the numbers. I put bets in for my dad. Uh, that's not good. No one seems to be arguing the fact that sports betting is already taking place illegally and often in plain sight. The lawmakers say the state is missing out on millions in potential revenue. They've got the interest of the public and the governor and say that makes fighting the federal government on this less daunting. In the newsroom, Brianna Venozzi, NJTV News.